It's a busy day in the island community at Wanakope. Children below 15 are going for fishing. Others are returning. But in the home of Mary Nyado, a mother of 10, there is trouble. Her twin six-month-old children are unwell, but she has no means of taking them to the Makango Polyclinic. My twin children are unwell, but there's no fuel to power the boat to take us to Makango Polyclinic. The Makango Polyclinic is the nearest advanced facility for residents in Awunakopo and other small villages beyond the water body. Even for them, it could take at least three to four hours to get there. At the facility, patients are streaking in for various health needs. But health workers here say despite the facility being recently opened, there are serious needs. Dr. Dokas Arthur is the officer in charge. Uh, we have a lot of challenges. We don't have enough space and then the theater. Another challenge is the lighting system. When there's light off, we can't do anything. Um, if somebody wants to pass a canola or a catheter, there's light off. We use our phones. The facility it drains when it rains. The lack of space has forced workers here to combine wards. Women and children share one ward while this wooden partition serves as a dispensary. East Gonja Municipal Health Director Zakaria Kasim says the absence of a laboratory and a theatre for the Makango Polyclinic is of concern to the municipality. A community, the wind sand there. So they take levy from the tipa tracks that uh, uh, wind is sand. So they have some money and the community has agreed to put up a theater, which uh, we are still uh, lobbying because these things take time. But we pray that by the close of the year, when the race stop, uh, the theater will be constructed. Then we also live with our politicians and prominent people within uh, the Salga municipality to donate some few equipment for us. While the health personnel wait for interventions, they wouldn't make do with what is available. We've also had a case whereby the patient was traveling, had an attack, a asthmatic patient came here as well. We don't have oxygen, so but we try to re uh, manage the patient. We're having cases, RTAs, they will come, you see. Their main uh, source of transportation is motor and then uh, try cycling, that's the motor king. So when they get accidents like that, they do come here. We try to stabilize them, we refer. The minister for fisheries, Smada comes from Makango. And from the information I had, she even championed the construction of that facility in Makango. So we have submitted a proposal to her uh, to get us a laboratory for now. We just want the structure and because there's a microscope, then we can start with the basic ones. Ghana failed to meet the Millennium Development Goal, now Sustainable Development Goal target of reducing maternal mortality rate by 75% by 2015. Even with seven years to the 2030 targets of the SDGs, Access to health services for many women in rural communities like Makango remains a challenge. The East Gonja municipality of the Savannah region has 39 health facilities, one polyclinic, which is the Makango Polyclinic, 20 chips facilities serving more than 122,000 people in the municipality, plus the Salaga Municipal Hospital. But the commensurate number of community health nurses Doctors and physician assistants mean the patient to nurse ratio keeps widening. Komla Adum TV3 News, Makango.